You're my baby, my lover, my lady. All night you make me want you. It drives me crazy. I feel like you were made just for me, babe. Tell me if you feel the same way. Cause it just feels so right I don't wanna waste no time If I had to choose, I know I'm gonna always choose to be with you Cause girl, don't you know Girl, don't you know you're so beautiful I wanna give all my love to you, girl Not just tonight, but the rest of your life I wanna be always here by your side Girl, don't you know you're so beautiful I wanna give all my love to you, girl Not just tonight, but the rest of your life I wanna be always here by your side When you're not here You don't know how much I miss you The whole time on my mind Is how much I'm gonna get to make you feel so good, like you know I could uh, Tell me if you feel the same way Cause it just feels so right I don't wanna waste no time Girl, if I had to choose, I know I'm gonna always choose to be with you Girl, don't you know Girl, don't you know
as we gather in the presence of God and these witnesses to join Marquez Booker and Delisa Wright in holy matrimony. It is an honorable estate instituted by God, signifying unto us the mystical union that is between Christ and his church. It is commended in scripture to be honorable among all, and therefore it is not to be entered into unadvisedly or lightly, but reverently and in the fear of God. Into this holy estate, these two persons present come now to be joined. Therefore, if any person can show just cause why these two may not lawfully be joined together as husband and wife, let them now speak or forever hereafter hold your peace. <laughs> Marriage is a gift from God given to us so that we might experience the joys of unconditional love and with a lifelong partner. God designed marriage to be an intimate relationship between a man and a woman. Marquez and Delisa, because of your deep love for each other, uh, God above, in this, sacred, in this sacred moment, it is with great reverence that I ask you to declare your intent. Let us pray. Father, gracious Heavenly Father, our hearts are filled with great happiness on this wedding day. And we are praying that Marquez and Delisa will have a blessed union. We ask you for your blessings now in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Marquez, do you take Jaleesa to be your wedded wife, to live together after God's ordinance in holy estate of matrimony? Do you promise to love her? I'm sorry. Yeah. Do you promise to love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, forsaking all others? Remain faithful to her as long as you both shall live. And Delisa, right, do you take Marquez to be your wedded husband to live after God's ordinance in holy estate of matrimony? Do you promise to love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health? forsaking all others, remain faithful to him as long as you both shall live. I do. Who gives this woman to this man to be married? Her mother. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you make it <laughs> <laughs> The Word of God says in 1 Corinthians 13, 4 through 7, from the New Living Translation, it talks about love. And it says, love is patient and kind. Love is not jealous or boastful or proud or rude. It does not demand its own way. It is not irritable. And it keeps no record of being wrong. Are you ready to take your vows at this time as husband and wife? If so, you may take one another by the right hand. By the right hand. Do you, Marquez Booker, take Delisa Wright, whom you hold by the hand, to be your true and lawful wife, to love and cherish her in joy or pain, in sickness or health, and forsaking all others, to cleave to her only as long as you both shall live? I do. <laughs> do you, Delisa, right, take Marquez Booker, whom you hold by the hand, to be your true husband, to love, honor, obey, 
and cherish him in joy or pain, in sickness or health, and forsaking all others to cleave to him only, so long as you both shall live. I get it. At this time, we are ready to extend the music over here. Okay. Before we do, the wedding ring serves as a symbol. You may turn the screen off. The wedding rings serve as a symbol of the promises you have just spoken. It is the outward and visible sign of an inward and invisible love that binds your two hearts together. The wedding ring also is a symbol of what God is. He is without beginning and without end. He is eternal. And as you can see, the ring is without beginning and without end. So I believe this exchange of rings not only reminds of us of an unending love you have for each other, but also reflects eternal love that God has for each of you. At this time, we will bless the rings. Heavenly Father, we ask that you would bless the rings that Marquez and Delisa wear, that they may abide in peace and continue in your favor until, until their life end through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. This time, uh, we're going to ask Mark Quinn if he would take the ring and place it on her left hand ring finger and go fold it. And repeat after me. I give you this symbol. At I give you this ring as a symbol of my love. I give you this ring as a symbol of my love. And faithfulness to you. And faithfulness to you. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. The Son. The Son. And the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Release as we would take this ring, hold it on his left hand ring finger. And repeat after me. I give you this ring. I give you this ring as a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And faithfulness to you. And faithfulness to you. In the name of the Father. The Son, the Son and the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. At this time, the groom and the and the bride will also seal their marriage with a sand ceremony. And so today, this relationship is symbolized through pouring of two individual containers into one. And so at this time, I'm going to ask you to walk up. The sand that Elisa is holding represents everything that she has been, all that she is, and all that she will be. The other represents the groom, all that Marquez has been, all that he is, and all that he will be. 
And just as these grains of sand can never be separated and poured into an individual container, so too will your marriage and your family forever be intertwined. <laughs> At this time, we're going to receive the wedding uh, blessing uh, from Bishop Pittman. He's going to come at this time and pray over the couple. Let us pray. Father of love, who has brought these two together to be made one in your holy matrimony. All thy servants here assemble now. And God bless these to be perfect marriage. They have the strength to share each other in the joy of sorrow to continue to bear one another's burden. May God continue to bless you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 <clears throat> Having pledged their fidelity to one another, to love, honor, and cherish one another in the presence of this gathering, and by the authority vested in me by the Constitution and laws of this state, it is my honor to now pronounce you husband and wife.
Everywhere but that corner.
Sit on top of you. We gon' fuck up the. 